Yeah, Sharon Jesus. Yeah, today's December 7th. It's, uh, uh, back in 1990, December 7th, my dad passed away. So I kind of had something different with me with December 7th. But uh, especially last year, uh, losing my mom, but she's 96, and then that was a blessing. Uh, but anyways, you know, what's going on today and stuff with uh, in, in the politics and stuff, I, and, and this came to me. My earthly father passed on this day so many years ago. My earthly mother is now 95. Her light on earth still glows. Roosevelt said this day, December 7th, will live in infamy. My parents' generation now with God the Father for all eternity. They fought for God and country against this world's tyranny. They gave their lives for, for freedom from sea to shining sea. Yes, young men and women, the ultimate sacrifice they made. For the world was in turmoil. This nation came to this world's aid. This day to me is different, though, when my father went to be with Jesus in heaven. The significance isn't Pearl Harbor each year on December 7th. Yes, those young people fought and died in, a, in God, a world to save. If they could see how far today we've drifted from Jesus, they would turn over in their graves. Let us hold fast to the profession of our faith without wavering. Time to put our trust and faith back in Jesus again. Don't think for a moment God doesn't have unfailing love for you. For his son Jesus died to forgive all sin. Fear not, for I am with thee. Let that be our battle cry. My parents lived this motto when they picked up their weapons and knew that they may die. For they had faith in God. They knew who won the war. Jesus Christ gave them victory over tyranny. Their spirit would be with God forevermore. This day to me is different when my father went to be with Jesus in heaven. The significance isn't Pearl Harbor each year, December 7th. Anyways, what came to me is just with this impeachment and all this going on and stuff like this, uh, you know, uh, what's happening, you know, we, we, we've taken the word out of schools. We've taken the word out of politics. And, and God just kind of went there and says, what, you don't want me anymore? And this is what happens. You got school shootings going on. Um, you know, it's just, uh, it's a time. There's a, it's a time right now that the Christians stand back up and say, you know, enough is enough. Maybe this is our Pearl Harbor. You know, maybe this day, this impeachment will end in, uh, live in infamy because it woke the people up. And, and let them know, hey, we're not going to just stand still and let this kind of, you know, um, tyranny go on any longer. Stand up. Stand up. Be a warrior for Jesus. God bless you and have a wonderful day.